Hello Internet, Big Dave here and I am cheap. How cheap? Well, I'm so cheap that I paid... Well, it's Voxatron. It's the Humble Voxatron debut bundle. This is Alpha Funding. I paid 15 bucks for the bundle, which includes Binding of Isaac and Blocks That Matter. Two games I already own, but oh well. So I guess technically speaking, I paid $15 for Voxatron, but that's not very cheap of me. So, uh... We'll slide that one under the table. We'll let that one go on a technicality, huh? When it comes to charity, I am anything but cheap. Um, so, I don't mind paying basically 15 bucks for Voxatron. Let's take a look at Voxatron. What is it? Well, aside from being part of the bundle, well, really the sole game in the bundle, it's a voxel-based game, and don't really ask me what voxels are. They're like 3D pixels. If you've played Minecraft, that's basically voxels boxes, 3D pixels, yeah, you know. So anyway, this is, uh, who made this game? Yeah, Lexa, Lexa Lawful. that's right, I was, it's a tongue twister. Uh, yeah, Lexa Lawful games, they have some other games, nothing I've really ever heard of, a lot of little platformers, 2D games, although they do have an amazing looking game called Cat Cat Watermelon, and it's exactly what you think it would be. It's on their website, lexalawful.com. It is a Flash game. It plays right in your browser. It's a game about stacking cats and watermelons. It is freaking awesome. So I haven't touched Voxatron at all. I've heard that the editor is very nice. Uh, we'll take a look at that at some point. I don't want to make this an extremely long video. I mean, this game is out there. It's part of the Humble Bundle, and it should be an easy enough decision for those of you who really like supporting indie developers, like supporting charity, and like supporting the Humble Bundle. Uh, so, I've set up all the options, and let's just go ahead and figure out what we can figure out. Let's see. Might as well go for adventure. Okay. I can jump. Uh, okay. Alright. Okay. There we go. Let's see, Z or C. Oh, wait, no, come back. I weren't done reading that. Please. Okay, well, I'm sure the, uh, I'm sure it'll just all work out for the best. Okay. That shoots. Okay. Okay, so... I'm, I'm supposed to shoot something. Oh! Okay, those those little men did not like the fact. How? Those little, these little men do not like the fact that I shot at their wall. Was that a chocolate bar that just dropped? I, I think it might have been. I'll never know. I'll never know. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, yes, it was. It was a chocolate bar. It was, in fact, a chocolate bar. Okay, so shooty, shooty, shooty. I like the way when you shoot stuff, uh, when you shoot the walls and things. Oh, triple shot. What does that mean? Oh, yeah. Wow, I exploded. Good lord. Okay. All right. So, okay. Uh, yeah, man, this is an interesting little game. I'm trying to figure out if there's any way... Oh, okay. I'm trying to figure out if there's any way to, like, strafe... Okay, there's, there's got to be some way to strafe. Of course, for all I know, it could have been included in that little startup message that I totally missed. Yes. Come and get you some. Oh, and an apple. Now, the apple's worth less than the chocolate. Is that a commentary? 
I, I personally enjoy apples, thank you very much. Oh, there's the present. Gives me the triple shot. And I, I shouldn't mess with this guy. Oh, and again! Man, that explosion is freaking impressive! Okay, okay. I have no idea what I'm doing. No idea. See, I'm really wishing... I'm really wishing I knew the controls. Or I had bothered to look at the controls. Uh, which I did not. Most definitely did not. Alright, alright, alright. What do we got here? More of these big giant dudes. Oh, sushi! Alright, bring it on, bring it on, bring it on. Oh, more sushi. Very nice, very nice. What I would really like to do is stop failing miserably at this game. Okay. There's the present. Oh my lord. Y'all need to get away from me. Oh, chocolate! I'll take it. There we go. Alright, this triple shot's working out nicely now. Oh, those guys run fast. Alright. Ooh. Oh, I got, a, I got an extra man. And there's some crazy-ass minotaurs. No, 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 sir. Oh, man. It's heating up. The action is heating up. Whoa. Okay. There you go. Get some of that. Oh, good lord. Those guys take a lot. Drop me an apple there. Oh, come on, Minotaur. Walk right into my... <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, a key. Oh, all right. Huh, interesting. All right, guys, well, I'm going to duck out and uh, take a look at the editor real quick, and then maybe we'll glance at the controls and come back to this. So let's go back to the title. Let's take a look at those controls. Oh, okay, so you can use a mouse. Alright, customize. Alright, up there, okay, shoot, jump, shoot left. Huh. Okay. What does it look like when you involve the mouse? WSD. Okay, that's going to be more natural. Alright, that just makes it more... Basically makes it a dual stick shooter at that point. Okay. That'll feel a lot better. That'll feel a lot better. So let's take a look at the... Whoa, editor. Uh, uh, I, wow. Okay, I feel like I just got myself in over my head. Okay, so they have some pre-designed objects that you can drop. That's cool. Looks like they have tabs for additionals. Got all our enemies here that we can drop in. That's pretty cool. I mean, it's not very often that you see a game with a full-featured editor like this. I mean, this is not just a this isn't just a level editor. This is a level editor. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, that's right. That guy knows what I'm talking about. Yeah, this is crazy. Place objects, pick colors. Wow. I mean, this is really move the camera. Man, yeah, that that is really full function. Man, I mean, if this is something that you like, I mean, if this is something that you find interesting, or if you just want to get your hands on sort of a, a, a low-level game design tool, something that you can use uh, to learn with, I mean, damn, this looks awesome. I mean, I, I gotta say. Okay, double-click to exit. So, yeah, let's try again. Let's do arcade this time. Okay, and now, there we go, there we go. 
Okay, I was going to say, I don't have a reticle, but I, I do. It's just right at my body, so that's cool. Okay, you hear me furiously clicking. Um, this feels more natural now. I can strafe around. Oh, what the... I just, I totally lost it. I was, I was going for that extra man. And I just didn't even care that I was getting overtaken by enemies. Whoa, that guy jumps. Oh, more minotaurs. I need a power up. Oh, what is that? Build? What, what do you mean build? <gasps> what? Oh, I can put stuff down? That is insane. That's crazy. Wow, I'm kind of... I wish I had an actual weapon. That's awesome. So I guess while you have that... While you have the build tool, you, know, you can sort of use that opportunity... Sort of like spruce up the level a little bit. Oh! I got stuck. Alright, let's do this crap. Yeah, it's definitely changed the dimension of the game now that I can kind of just dual stick it like this. Okay, you can get up on the sides. Okay, okay. Yeah, things. It's feeling a lot better now, a lot more sort of fluid. Oh, yeah. Ooh, some kind of a life power-up. Alright. This is just, it's just a fantastic, uh, a fantastic good old retro time. I mean, I don't know what, I'd like to know what more they're going to do with the game. Um, obviously, as this is the, the alpha funding, uh, it's alpha. Uh, so I'd love to know that. Oh, I got the build. I got the build again. I feel like I'm being frivolous with the build stuff. Okay. Okay, I can see I got a up in the corner. It shows me how many spaces I have left. Okay. Awesome. Yeah, I'd be anxious to know what you know what more they see happening with the game if if they're going to continue to support uh, you know the community, the building community, uh, the map making community. You know, that would be really, really cool if they did that. Uh, continue to ve develop the game, you know, to continue to develop... Ooh, 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 life, life, life. You know, continue to develop um, tools for the game. I mean, it looks like there's some amazing uh, tools just in the build editor itself. I mean, it's, it's just... I can't believe I'm not dead yet. <laughs> um, this game looks really promising. I mean, really interesting. Is it? Is it, It's not redefining any genres. I find myself saying that so, so often. Um, I mean, it's redefining a genre in, in a way. I mean, this is a pretty cool way to do a a, a little retro style dual stick shooter. Um, is that an armadillo? What? Okay, that was some kind of smart bomb or something. That's crazy. Oh, what the hell is that? Oh my lord, the levels just get trashed. Oh no 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 you get you no 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 get away from me get away from me All he is Oh good lord Y'all no get 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 back 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 okay sushi sushi I require it Oh man this level is totally trash I mean I, I love that I love that aspect This level's just getting completely smashed Oh man, it's great! I mean, I'm having fun, you know? I'm having fun. This game is, it's, to this point, uh, I, I can't speak on, of course, what it's going to be like later on. Uh, you know, this game is a one-trick pony, but it does that trick pretty damn well. And I do feel like I, I say that a lot about, uh, I've said that a lot about games recently. Uh, but it does sort of have that Nation Red vibe, like, what does this game do? Well, it just, it does one thing awesome. Oh, good lord. Y'all, y'all get back. Yo, act like you've got some sense. Okay. Oh, what? What? Oh, oh my god, I'm a knight of some sort. 
Yeah, yo, come on, come on, get it. Get it, yeah. Okay, okay. This is... Am I a girl knight? I can't... I'm something. Okay, back on the P-gun. Oh, man. Okay, okay, I mean... This is really, really nice. I mean, it, it's... There's a skill component here. There's... Oh! This is almost like... Uh, I mean, it's like a really, like, a zombie horde shooter. I mean, it's... it's I'm getting... The more I play it, the more I start to get a sort of a Nation Red vibe. Uh, it does have cool, uh, you know, cool power-ups. Man, and the destruction of the level is so cool. And then the added ability to uh, to go back and build it back up when you get the build tool. Oh, man. Okay, okay, this, this is cool. Oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, guys, well, uh, I don't know if there's really necessarily anything more to say about Voxitron. Uh, the Humble Voxitron debut bundle is currently uh, on HumbleBundle.com. Take a look at it if you're really interested. Um, I'm going to keep going. Uh, uh, yeah, so I hope if you're on the fence about the bundle, you found this video interesting. I am uh, I'm, I'm recommending this game. I really like it. Uh, I, I don't really think I can give it a rating in this state. Oh my god, it's a snail. And he does things with slime. That's insane. Oh, that is insane. Uh, yeah, I'm not really prepared to rate the game. What I will tell you is I'm having a hell of a time. A hell of a fun time. And I'm really enjoying myself playing this game. Oh, that's great. The snail's slime trail. That's fantastic. Oh. Freeze! And there's nothing to freeze. Oh, my lord. Look at that thing. Oh, my lord. Okay, I was trying to sign... It's vomiting. It's vomiting at me. It's like ra rainbow sparkly light vomit. Oh... Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's, it's projectile vomiting in my general direction. Technicolor rainbow vomit. Okay. Uh, yeah. Uh, all right, guys. Uh, I have been Big Dave. This is Voxatron. Check it out. I would highly recommend it. I'm really, really enjoying this game. And don't forget, if you give more than the current, uh, than the current average, you can get Binding of Isaac and Blocks That Matter. All right, guys. I have been Big Dave. And until next time, uh, take it easy. Aww. All right, guys. Take it easy.